Woo! We have covered a lot. We now know about markups, shop drawings, and permit drawings. Markups are the handmade sketches that turn into professionally drafted shop drawings. We learned that shop drawings are useful for coordination between all parties, but in order to get approved for installation, we need permit drawings. We also learned that permit drawings are the result of many layers of qualified design, field expertise, and information to meet applicable codes and local AHJ requirements. Once you have approved permit drawings, you are ready to proceed with the installation. However, installers may need a bit more information or not. So, this is when installation drawings come in. In most cases, installation drawings can be the same set of approved permit drawings with the addition of other helpful things. Installation drawings provide more details such as additional elevation details, device connections, mounting details, FACP and panel elevations, detailed point-to-point -point diagrams, and even a device programming matrix and everything the installation crews will need. Installation drawings are helpful when a national contractor hires local subcontractors to do the installation. In all circumstances, it is always quite helpful to have everything needed on the same set of drawings. Additional details on the installation drawings are optional but there is no doubt that adding accurate details facilitates the installation process. Adding more details to the drawings does mean a bit higher cost, however, coordination then goes smoother and therefore project installations costs are minimized when enough detail is provided through installation drawings. But again, this is an option. It is always a good idea to budget for enough CAD work for installation drawings early in the project. Well. We are done learning about insulation drawings. It's time for the next round, as-built drawings. In our next video, we will learn how your insulation drawings can now be used to mark up the changes made on the field. Keeping track of any changes is helpful to keep a record for any potential change orders. For more about as-built drawings, please see our next video, Drawing Types Part 6, As-Built Drawings. See you soon!